Good morning, friends. Hope you all are fit and fine by the grace of Allah. Yes, I am fine too. Welcome to our English class. Myself, Tamanna Rahman, assistant teacher of Dhaka Match Industry Secondary School. Today, we are going to learn another new chapter from the book English for Today, classes 9-10. And the unit is 7, Lesson 6, Love for Humanity. So friends, at first we have a picture. Yes? What can I see here? We have a known face. She is Mother Teresa. We learned about her in the previous lesson. And... Here, Mother Teresa is seen with a lot of children and holding one too. So now friends, let's have a look to the text where we can have more information about Mother Teresa and her work. Mother Teresa was moved by the sight of the sick and dying on the streets of Kolkata. She found a home for the dying destitute and named it Nirmal Hridoy, meaning pure heart. Here there is a new word which is destitute. Destitute means extremely poor, who is penniless. There is no money. The people there who has who have no money is called destitute. So she found a home for the dying destitute and named it Nirmal Hridoy. She and her fellow that brought the dying people of the streets of Calcutta to this home. The dying destitute are taken to the home which is called Nirmal Hridoy. Mother Teresa and the team did the work. They were lovingly looked after and cared of. Since then, many men, women, and children have been taken from the streets and carried to Nirmal Hridoy. These unloved and uncared for people get an opportunity to die in an environment of kindness and love. Friends, we have a new word too here, which is opportunity. Opportunity is a chance or scope. That's a new one. In their last hours, they get human and divine love and can feel they are also children of God. Here we have the word divine. Divine is a new word which means connected to God. The missionaries of charity try to find jobs for those who survive or send them to homes where they can live happily for some more years in a Caring environment. We have a word here, charity. Charity is a fund or we can say foundation on an organization which is set up to provide help by raising money for those. Okay, this is charity. It's a fund. The missionary of charity try to find jobs for those who survive. The word survives means to continue to live. Okay, continue to live is survive. So those who survive and send them to homes where they can live happily for some more years in a caring environment. Regarding commitment to family, Mother Teresa said, maybe in our own family, we have somebody who is feeling lonely, who is feeling sick, and who is feeling worried. Are we there? 
okay here the here the word regarding means concerning somebody or something okay regarding means concerning somebody or something so regarding commitment commitment is also a new word commitment is a promise okay the a promise to do something in a particular way is commitment so regarding commitment okay without commitment without promise to family mother teresa sorry without it's not without regarding that means concerning somebody so about the promise to family mother teresa said maybe in our own family we have somebody who is feeling lonely who is feeling sick and who is feeling worried worried which is anxious or concerned okay wh when we are outside home or we are late to go home from school then our parents get worried worried is a situation Wor worried is a, a state of mind which is anxious so we can say sh who is feeling worried worried means anxious or concerned are we there are we willing to give until it hurts in order to be with our families or do we put our interest for it here willing is a word which is eager or wishful not objecting to doing something is willing and heart is a common word we all know about it heart that means uh, uh, injure or wound sometimes while playing we get we may get hurt by falling down okay injury heart is injury it hurts in order to be with our family and do we put our interests first interest here is concern or matter we must remember that love begins at home and we must also remember that future of humanity passes through the family okay here the word humanity that is uh, the quality of the state of being human okay the quality of being human is humanity so we must remember that love begins at home not in the any charitable organization or other places it begins at home and we must also remember that future of humanity passes through the family mother teresa's work has been recognized throughout the world okay we all know about mother teresa's work and she received a number of awards these include the pope john 13 peach prize from 1971 the nehru prize for promotion of international peace and understanding from 1972 the belgian prize from 1978 and the nobel peace prize 1979 and the Bharat Ratna 1980 the Nobel Peace Prize of, of uh, 1979 which is really very important when we uh, uh, know about Mother Teresa and Mother Teresa died at the age of 87 on 5th September 1997 we have a new word here friends it's promotion we all know about this promotion which is a activity uh, that helps to encourage that helps or encourages the progress or success we can say okay the success helping by uh, for promotion or for success we use the word promotion to encourage more success in the future okay the word seducer for her love and the compassion for humanity she has taught us how to extend our hands towards those who need our love and support irrespective of creed caste and religion we have a word here extend extend is a simple word which is uh, offer okay 
offer or uh, express, extend a synonymous word. We have another word which is uh, irrespective. Irrespective means without considering something or regardless uh, of. Okay, considering something is regarding and without considering something is irrespective. So, irrespective of creed, caste and religion. Here the word creed. Creed means a set of beliefs or opinion. That means creed is belief. Creed, caste and religion. Okay. The picture of Mother Teresa draped in a white and blue bordered shari with a wrinkled face, ever soft eyes and a saintly smile lives on in our mind. Okay, friends, we have uh, the word here draped. Drape. Drape means cover. Okay, drap means cover. And the wrinkled, wrinkled is lined. That means having or showing a small fold or line in the skin caused by our age. When we are growing older, uh, we are getting aged, then we may have wrinkles on our faces. Okay, so. Uh, we have the picture okay you can see here uh, wrinkle our mother Teresa draped in white sorry blue border so friends this is the end of the text so now we have some true false okay we have some true false we need to find out which is which one is false and if it is false we need to put it in for the correct answer the first one is Mother Teresa was moved to see the diseases that spread in the streets of Kolkata. It is false. Okay. Not to see the diseases. To see the sick and dying people. So the diseases is not the correct one. She opened a home for the orphans. She opened a home for the orphans. Uh, any guesses? Is it true or false? Yes, it's also false because she opened a home not for the orphans, for the dying destitute. Okay, the word orphan is the people who have without parents. That means who do not have parents, father or mother. This is called orphan. But dying destitute, the people who are going to die and uh, penniless. That means do not have money. And they are dying destitute. So Mother Teresa opened the home for the dying destitute. She and her group brought in the dying people from the streets of Kolkata. Yes, it's a true one. Oh, definitely Mother Teresa with the team brought the dying people from the streets of Kolkata. So number three is true. Number four. Nirmal Hridoy was founded so that the poor people who are dying can get love and care before death. Nirmal Hridoy. Yes, it's also a true one because Nirmal Hridoy was set, set up so that the poor people can get some love and care before their death. They are going to die. They do not have money. So they are getting love and care from Nirmal Hidoy and this that was the step of Mother Teresa with the team. Number five, Mother Teresa said that humanity passes through charitable organization. That is definitely false because Mother Teresa said that humanity passes through but not by the charitable organization. Through what? Through the family. Yes, through the family. Mother Teresa said that humanity passes through the family. We have learned from Mother Teresa how to come forward to help only those who belong to a special caste. It's false because we have learned from Mother Teresa how to come forward to help people irrespective of creed, caste and religion. So, <coughs> number six is false. Only number three and four is true. So friends, we have 
some more verbs but not for the class it's your we have some questions here the first one is why do you think mother teresa won so many awards what does nirmal ridoy stand for the first one is why do you think mother teresa won so many awards and number two is what did sorry what does nirmal ridoy stand for that means what's the meaning of nirmal ridoy number three why do you think the home is named nirmal ridoy why do you think the home is named nirmal ridoy number four why did mother teresa want the dying people to feel that they too deserve care and love number four why did mother teresa want the dying people to feel that they too deserve care and love number five what are the things that we have learned from mother teresa the last one num that means number five what are the things that we have learned from mother teresa <coughs> friends this is the end of today's class so if you have any problem feel free to ask me and always stay fine stay blessed take care of yourself do your homework study regularly thank you